Yes, my friends, today we're gonna be here at Volcano Bay. This is gonna be a lot of fun. I'm really excited to see everything Volcano Bay has to offer, although I don't think we're gonna get to everything today. We'll get to see at least a good chunk of it. I'm excited to see how the Tapu Tapu system works and get a feel of the grounds. Hi everybody and welcome to the world of Micah. Today we are gonna be here at Universal's Volcano Bay. It's gonna be a ton of fun. I'm gonna try and show you guys as much as I can. Let's take a closer look. Let's take a closer look. Here at Volcano Bay, they have something called a Tapu Tapu. It's a wearable device, just like I have here on my wrist. And you use it for the virtual line. You walk up and scan, tells you when to return, but you have to return this as you exit the park. So this is not for you to keep, but it is something for you to wear while you're here. Oh my gosh, would you look at that view? That's the wave pool. Look at that. But you can also use your Tapu Tapu to have little interactive things happen while you're here. See, I just made that fountain turn on in the lazy river just by touching it with my Tapu Tapu. And now I'm gonna get a return time. See, just got a return time here for the Krakatau, the water coaster they have here. You just walk up and scan and it'll tell you your return time right here on this Tapu Tapu. See right there, it says 50 minutes for Krakatau and it will tell me when it's time for me to ride. And there's lots of things to see and do while you're waiting for your return time. Also, when you have a return time on your Tapu Tapu, if you see an attraction that says ride now, you can go straight onto that ride without losing your space in line with your Tapu Tapu. Does that make sense? And I will say the atmosphere here is absolutely incredible. We're gonna check out the Tiawa, the Fearless River. You gotta wear a life vest, and we gotta get used to this water. Safety first. It's cold. Yeah, it is really cold. You can see everybody's getting used to the water. You got the, the life vest. They make you wear this life vest because it is the Fearless River. Ooh, yikes, it's cold. Ooh, it's cold. <laughs> it's a little cold. It's also still morning time, so. And that's what we're currently waiting on, the Krakatau coaster. It's pretty awesome, I can't wait to ride that. And you get an awesome view. But man, this water, it really takes off. This is cool. Just lean back and go with the flow. This is awesome. I wonder if the GoPro is getting like a steady cam shot Keep my hand as steady as I can. This is cool. Literally just floating down a river. And you can see some of the inner workings. Oh, there's one of the blasters. I just felt it blowing on my leg. <laughs> That's so awesome. That's what the inside of the volcano looks like. Oh yeah, we're really moving now. This is so cool. I mean, it's only three feet. But if you lift your legs, you just go with the flow. I haven't had to do really any work the entire time I've been in here. And you have awesome surf music playing. Look at the bubbles. And then there's parts that just drop completely. Like I can't stand. Whoa, it's a little deeper. Dude, your, your surfers are killer. I'm not joking. You can just stick aside right there. <laughs> a team member just complimented me on my sideburns. <laughs> Yeah, he said, uh, and I quote, I have the sickest sideburns ever. <laughs> and then you have the option to get out here or you can keep going around and there's an awesome waterfall geyser. It's not a waterfall, it's a geyser coming out of the rock work here. This is so cool. So yeah, you don't have to do the complete park. It does go all the way around the park. You can get out here if that's your destination. All right. And if you choose to stay on, we've got some wave action. Look at the waves. <laughs> I've never been in a lazy river that has waves. Oh, this is so cool. <laughs> what did it get you? <laughs> this is so cool. 
<laughs> I've never been in a lazy river that has waves. <laughs> oh, this is awesome. That was so awesome. I've never been on a jungle river quite like that. So now I think we're gonna kill the 25 minutes we still have left until we can try the crack a towel. I wanna go inside here. Don't wanna do the slide, but I wanna go inside this volcano. And we found a way to get in without actually having to ride the slides. Oh, no way. Look at this view of the Wayful and Cabana Bay Resort on both sides. This is awesome. The view of the, the volcano. Look at that. The waterfall coming off the rocks here. Wow. Wow, this is so cool. <laughs> How incredible is this? Oh man, we're inside the volcano now. All the colors and everything, this is so cool. And there's more interactive things here. Scan the Tapu Tapu and check it out. I'm in control of the water. I'm moving the joystick. I'm moving all those little water spouts over there around. All right, let's see exactly what this one does. Oh, no way, look at that. Wow. It's lighting up the whole inside. Whoa. Now that's cool. Oh, holy cow, look. Wait, wait, come back there. Tiki God. And that's it. So if you do not want to ride the slides in the volcano, you don't have to. And there's a few interactive things inside of it that you can do while you're killing time for another attraction. Speaking of time, on my Tapu Tapu, it says we have exactly 15 minutes until we can ride Krakatau. And now I think we're gonna go get some, some dessert, a special ice cream they have here. Hoka Paroka Ice Cream Kona where they have a Waturi Fusion. It's a mixture of banana, blue raspberry, orange, and strawberry. But they also have different other kinds of ice cream. Your typical chocolate, vanilla, banana, orange, strawberry, blue raspberry. But they have pineapple, coconut, and mango as well. And they do Sundays here. But we're just gonna check out that Watura, or Waturi, excuse me, I cannot see that I there. Waturi Fusion. I'm excited to see exactly what this is. Holy cow. Look at this. All the different colors, everything blended together. This is awesome. And we got it on a waffle cone too. And you can find nice places to sit right over here next to the waterfalls and enjoy the ice cream. What do you think about the ice cream? It's really good. I wasn't sure about the flavors because I'm not a, like I like oranges and I like blueberry, but I don't know if I like the artificial flavor, but it's really good. And he said that if you wanted to make your own like multicolored ice cream, um, the Watcher Fusion is the only way you can do up to four flavors, but you can do three flavors the other way. Oh, so you so, can mix three different flavors. Yeah, you can mix three different flavors, but it's really cool. It's good. You can see all the different colors there. It tastes like cotton candy to me. I'm not quite sure what it tastes like, but it's really, it is really good. Yeah, I like it. Yeah, I can sit here for quite some time. Take in the views, scenery, the ambiance, the uh, the music here is very relaxing, and the plants and trees. It doesn't feel like we're right next to I-4. <laughs> like I-4 is right there between those bushes, yeah. but it doesn't feel like we're that close to I-4. Tropical paradise. We're in a tropical paradise. Yeah. We're down to the banana flavoring, and luckily, Abby's not a fan of banana, so this is gonna be all for me. Return anytime. And it vibrated. It lets you know by vibration. So I can return and ride whenever I want. Major fail 
I'm having to put the GoPro in the locker to ride. They don't let you use GoPros. So unfortunately, they're not letting me film on the Aqua Coaster with the GoPro. Not understanding why they really couldn't explain it to me, but it's okay. Rules are rules. And I'm not here to break the rules, but I can at least show you guys what the coaster looks like from a distance. So this is the coaster. You take off down here and it shoots you back up. You go all through the big volcano there and then do a big drop right here at the end where it takes your photo. It's a lot of fun. I really enjoyed it. I wish I could have filmed it for you guys, but rules are rules and I'm not in control of those rules. I think we saw a good chunk of Volcano Bay today. If you would like to support my channel, please visit my Patreon page at patreon.com slash world of Micah. We're doing any $1 a month can help fund episodes just like this. I had a lot of fun at Volcano Bay. Even though I could not film on the slides, it was still a wonderful day here. I'll definitely be back. I'll see you on the next episode of World of Micah, everybody. Until then, stay weird. Goodbye. <laughs>